Pastor George Borkard, and this is another Higher Things video short. Jesus is the only one standing on his own. That's the subject of today's Higher Things video short. Sometimes we might feel ourselves to be right. We might think ourselves to be so right, so correct, and on such strong footing that we're in danger. And what I mean by that is that we're in danger of sin. It is the point in which we believe that we're most standing on our own two feet, that we're, that we're right and we're, we're, we're justified and that, that the other person needs to repent and that, they, that we've got them on the run, that we are most susceptible to the flaming arrows of the evil one. You see, the only rightness in this life is Christ. The only justification before God is the is is by faith alone apart from our works apart from our rightness the only thing the only ground on which we can stand is the hallowed ground of calvary where his blood and water flowed for our sins anything else is a slippery slope and a dangerous ground when we think that we're right when we think we've got everything together when we believe that we are most justified that's where we're going to fall. And that fall may not be um, evident to us even. We just might be lost inside. Cold and arrogant and icky and full of death. Unable to see that it's the goodness of God that causes repentance to others. And it's the goodness of God that causes repentance to us. When you think you're most right, remember this video and stop. Repent of your sins, your pride and your arrogance. You're having to have it your way. And believe and run to the suffering and death of Christ. The only rightness is your baptism. The only solid ground is the word of absolution. I forgive you all your sins. The, the, the place in which we are most firm before God is in the body and blood of Jesus given and shed for us on the forgiveness, uh, on, on the cross, delivered to us in under the bread and the wine. We've got no place to stand other than Jesus. No firm footing other than his death. And when we think we've got something to stand on, that's the point in which we need to repent. But where when you think that you're standing, lest you fall, Temptation is knocking at your door, and the cure for it is not to get your stuff together. The cure for it is Calvary and Easter. I'm Pastor George Borgard, and this is another Higher Things video short.